Hey guys, in my last video we covered a few leaks we got about the upcoming season. I'm sure you guys must have watched the Warriors 10, so I'm not going to go in depth about everything that happened during the Warriors 10 livestream. By the way, I post these updates on my Instagram page. Check it out if you want a quick update about the game. Alright, so today we're gonna be speculating about the new hero. So the new hero is a samurai that belongs to the Horkos faction, just like we guessed in our last video. Now let us look at what else we can gather from his reveal trailer. Before we get into that, I would like to mention one small detail that you guys may have missed. One week before the release of the new character, we are getting a new event called Covenant Games. This event might be similar to last year's Tyrant's Test event. In case you guys don't remember, that was the event in which Warmonger was revealed to us. So we may receive a similar reveal this time. Alright, so let's get back to the new hero. Looking at the hero reveal trailer, a few things stood out to me. This frame right here, I know this may not seem like much, but when you look at him, he seems similar to Tozen. This is just speculation, but even the title Mirage suits Tozen a lot. The second frame that stood out to me was this one. Here we get a good look at the outline of his weapon and armor. His armor looks very similar to Ishikawa from Ghost of Tsushima. So I think his default armor might look like this, which is just standard samurai armor. But there is another important detail in this frame, which is his weapon. If you take a close look, this katana does not have a guard and this character also has a sheath. If I'm not mistaken, this is the first hero to receive a sheath along with his weapon. I'm pretty sure this sheath is not just for show and will have a gameplay mechanic to it. So what could this gameplay mechanic be? The first thing that came to mind is this. If the sheath is not just for show, then I think his playstyle will be somewhat similar to this. We can already see a few moves that can be brought into the game. This move is a bash attack from neutral which can be used as an opener. And this move will be his zone attack. Anyway, so the third part of this trailer that stood out to me is this frame. Once again the devs are teasing us that it may or may not be Tozen. All of these dudes look the same. Once again hinting at Tozen's clones. Maybe he perfected his technique and now can make more clones. Because in the first glimpse we see three guys standing next to each other, which is the same amount of clones Tozen managed to make during his boss fight. But now you see around 10 people standing here. So I don't know, maybe I'm digging too deep into this, but who knows, maybe it's true. Alright, so the last thing that stood out to me was this quote. And the community is split about what this dude is trying to say. It's either Tengu Vareniari or Tenun Vareniari. The first one translates to I am the devil and the second one translates to the will of the heaven is mine. So yeah, it could be either one of them. And both of these quotes actually suit the character really well. So I can't decide which one is actually right. And that's pretty much it when it comes to the new character. He will have some classic samurai armor, his weapon has a sheath which will most likely be used in his moveset in some way. So what do you guys think? Do you have any more speculations of your own? Let me know in the comments below.